when you heard the news that you were the top girl in this year's common entrance examination, um, how, how, how did you feel? How are you feeling? I'm feeling very nervous. I actually didn't, I wasn't expecting to be the top girl. I was actually just enjoying my summer at my grandmother and then I heard my mom call and she said I was the top girl and at that point I was very shocked because I didn't know I was going to be the top girl. <laughs> but the principal said that you, your results throughout the year, I guess the past couple of years, would have shown that um, the results here today are no surprise to the school, so it shouldn't be to you as well. So tell me what have you been doing to prepare yourself for such a well, I have been going to lessons and I have been studying. I've also been going through work when I don't understand. Anything else you did? Did you have to give up any games or anything? Any extracurricular activities that you enjoy doing? Um, no, I didn't have to give up any extra, uh, extra curricular activities. Were there Throughout the exam, were there any parts that you felt were challenging to you? Yes, during the grammar, when I got when I got to some questions, I was a bit confused. So I read them over, and then I finally realized what they meant. In the math, not really. So, you have any, so like coming through after this, you go to Queens College. Do you have any career aspirations after this? Yes, I would like to be a veterinarian when I grow up. Yeah. Why a veterinarian? Because I just love taking care of animals. Any words you want to say to your daughter at this time? Any words you want to say to the school? Um, well, I would like to start by telling the school thank you very much for taking care of our precious daughter and guiding her to this point. Uh, we wouldn't be here without you guys and the lovely environment that the school provides. Um, one thing that I think was a real asset to Nan, you asked the question if she had to give up any extracurricular activities. The, the, the philosophy of the school is a very well-rounded philosophy. So the children learn, in my opinion, um, a lot of balance, right? And how to uh, manage your time, which I think um, helps them cope with a lot of the stresses that others may be feeling. So. Um, going into this, I told my wife, you know, our job is really just to make sure she's in a calm place and she'll do what she's supposed to do, right, um, which we um, got from the school. In terms of Anaya, um, I would have told you a million times already before we even got here, we are so proud of, proud of you. We knew you had the potential to do it, and we are seeing the fruits of your labor, honey. You're very dedicated, very thorough. Um, one of the best, uh, I guess, if I say so, it might be a bit biased, best students that <laughs> the school had in terms of attitude and approach to work um, and everything else. So while it's a surprise, it's not a surprise. <laughs> and enjoy the moment, honey. Congratulations. What plans do you have for Anaya? Well, <laughs> we'll come up with that as we go, but definitely we got to spoil her for the next... Um, couple of weeks during summer because she's <laughs> earned it. Yeah? Uh, anything you particularly you want to do to celebrate? Well, maybe go to the beach and then maybe after go to Shafet have some ice cream, you know. And definitely go to Starbucks <laughs> as well. Can I get a few words from Mo? Because this is very emotional <laughs> for you. Uh, what's going through your mind? See, you were, Lily, you were shedding some tears. Yes, <laughs> yes. When I heard, I screamed. I called my husband. I was shaking. I was trembling because I was like, is that Anaya Seeley? But there's no Anaya Seeley. It has to be Anaya. And I started to scream and I called him and he started to scream. And we were both excited. But she put in the work. She really did. She, she's a good student from, as they said from before, she's always very conscientious. She still did her dancing. She still did her swimming. She knew how to balance you know, her schoolwork and her extracurricular activities. And we are so proud of her. So proud of you.